guys, I think I'm becoming an active wear bodysuit type of gal. Jaws will drop. I know, it's shocking, but with a bodysuit this cute, whew, how can you blame me? Let's do this review. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Elaine. Welcome, welcome. I'm a weight loss coach, a fitness enthusiast, and an active wear lover. And today we are reviewing a dupe of Bombshell Active Wear's Sculpted Bodysuit Shorts from AliExpress. Now, with my dupe reviews, I always like to say that if you are able to afford the original product from Bombshell Activewear, please go do so. But I also understand that not everyone is able to afford a $135 bodysuit in Canadian or a $98 bodysuit in USD. So I believe that every woman deserves to look good and feel good in the gym. That is why I do these dupe reviews. Now this dupe is from AliExpress and the name of this actual set is called, <clears throat> excuse me, the Backless Sports Jumpsuit Woman 2021 Lycra Fitness Overalls One Piece sport, Shorts Sports Outfit Gym Workout Clothes for Women Sportswear. I'm just going to call it the activewear bodysuit in this review so that we can skip over that all that nonsense. But if you find videos like this useful, you better make sure to smash that like and that subscribe button. My measurements are always in the description box for your convenience and this video is timestamped so that you can skip to the part that is most interesting to you. Now I do not have the original bombshell activewear suit, bodysuit to compare this to, but just from a visual standpoint, this is an extremely impressive dupe of the Bombshell Activewear bodysuit. The only difference that I've noticed thus far is that the booty seams on the Bombshell Activewear bodysuit are not as pronounced as they are on the AliExpress dupe, and the composition is different. So this bodysuit is mainly a nylon blend, and the Bombshell Activewear bodysuit is a polyester blend. So just a slightly different feel, but overall, if you're looking for a similar style to the Bombshell Activewear bodysuit, this is as close as you are going to get for a much more affordable price. This is about about a fifth of the price if you're Canadian, a third of the price if you are in the US. So yeah, you are going to be saving a lot of money if you decide to go with this AliExpress dupe. And this exact top, this exact bodysuit will be linked down in the description box for you to go and grab it if you decide that this is a piece that you want for yourself. Now without further ado, let's get on with this review. General details of the activewear bodysuit. So this is, like I said, a nylon elastane blend bodysuit. It kind of almost feels cottony to the touch. It's not a slick feeling, performance feeling fabric. It actually feels like more of like a sweat absorbing type of material. But with this, we have a slight v-neck at the top here. And then we've got a simple plain bodysuit down the front, which stops at about a 5.5 inch length. If we were to look at the inseam from the crotch to the bottom of the shorts, there is a little bit of a hem at the bottom of the shorts, but apart from that, there's nothing much going on in the front. Now, the straps at the top, they go, they're thin spaghetti straps that turns into this gorgeous a pattern in the back. As you can see, we've got a lot of straps going on, but it forms this cute crisscross A shape at the back. And then we've got a little dip at the bottom here before we get into the shorts component of the bodysuit where we have some curved booty seams back here. And then we have another glute seam right down the middle. Now, if you know me and you're an OG, you know that I love me a nice booty seam because I find that they separate the cheeks so well and I just like the look of it. As you can see, my cheeks are separated. We got a full on peach back here. There is no diaper booty going on there. And then we've got some nice and high booty seams as well, which just completes the look. There is no logo on this whatsoever. So from the back and the entire bodysuit is wrapped, it's rather plain with the exception of this gorgeous detailing in the back. For the sizing, I got the olive color or the green color in my usual size small. This 
fits true to size for me. I would say that if you're someone who's between sizes and you've got thicker than average thighs, that's the only time that I would recommend sizing up because the at the quads I am getting some cutting in over here but otherwise you could go with a smaller size especially if you're someone who has a flatter stomach if you're someone who does hold more weight in your midsection you might want to consider sizing up as well and or if you're a girl who has larger than average titties because there is no adjustability to the top components of this bodysuit and it's overall a very low support so you've got you might want to size up so that you can get a bit more room in the chest area for the bra component of this bodysuit we are looking at a low support a newspaper will do to look at some boobs if you're someone who has smaller girls than me you may even get a medium support but we're not working with much for support in this area we do have Cu removable cup pads in here they are thin they just kind of sit there to kind of cover your nipples and then we do have a built-in bra component here that i can't really show you unless i take off the entire bodysuit and flip it inside out that is the downside of bodysuits we all know this we go into it knowing exactly what to expect but there isn't a lot of support going on here especially with the straps being so thin and there being no adjustability so just adjust your expectations when you get this this is not necessarily the bodysuit that i would be doing a lot of hit or intense cardio in but you can honestly just wear it out and about as a normal bodysuit if that's what you prefer i just would not be expecting a lot of support in the chesticle area for the comfort of this bodysuit overall i could wear it all day to be honest even though we do have spaghetti straps going on at the top here i still find it comfortable yes the spaghetti straps do cut a little bit into my traps but it's not anything horrendous if anything i feel like the spaghetti straps should be a little bit tighter so that i could get a little bit more coverage because i find that this just tends to sit very low on my chest and it's not like a comfortable fit in this i am getting a high amount of side boob going on so if you're a girl who has bigger than average titties then you should be expecting there to be a lot of side boob and i feel as if the side boob issue may have been fixed if we could just get a little bit more of a lift here so that it's not just so that the top of this bodysuit is not sitting so low but this may be just due to the fact that i have a short torso and i'm a shorter girl so this is just sitting a little bit lower than on me than it would for an average heighted female for the waist area of this bodysuit so it does just sit on my skin there's not a lot of contouring going on in the midsection it's not doing anything to hold me in or hold in my belly fat so if you're someone who does hold a lot of weight in your midsection and or you have love handles or any lumps and bumps in your midsection this bodysuit will potentially accentuate it because at the end of the day think of it like a bodycon dress in activewear form it just sits very tight to your skin so it will show everything that's going on if you're someone who's not comfortable with that then body suits in general for activewear pieces may not be it for you but i encourage you like if this is something that you're really interested in and you got a little bit of belly fat honey rock it i got belly fat too and i really do love how this looks on me i just think it looks so cute especially from the back so if you're someone who's feeling a little bit self-conscious but you've always wanted to try an activewear bodysuit this is your chance this is your sign go grab it because even if you are holding more belly fat and it's not giving you tummy control believe me you are perceiving your belly fat probably worse than it actually is but just be aware that this is not going to hide or smooth anything over in your midsection for the crotch i do have a little bit of extra crotch fabric but there's not too too much and i don't we don't have a front seam there so there's low to medium camel toe it's going to be low camel toe if you're someone who wears underwear with your activewear we all know that i like to go commando so i do get more of a medium camel toe with the shorts component of the bodysuit especially when i'm working out because these shorts do move everywhere or the shorts component moves everywhere and it will ride up since it is a shorter inseam so just be aware of that if you're someone who is of a similar frame to me and you're going to get this these shorts will move up and will ride up and you may get some fabric going into your coochie as well resulting in the good old 
camel toe. So this is low to medium camel toe, depending on whether you decide to go commando or you decide to wear underwear. For the sweats and functionality, you will see crotch sweat in this colorway. Now, if you were to get the black, I believe the black is still in stock, especially if you're in Canada, then you are probably going to get it to be more sweat wicking. But I didn't see a lot of crotch sweat. I just saw a little bit of crotch sweat closer to the end of my workout. So this is slightly sweat wicking, but you will eventually see the sweat break through. I found it's more so at my crotch, not necessarily at my breast area and I think that's because of the built-in bra. I feel like the built-in bra component of this bodysuit does its job to absorb a little bit of the sweat so that it takes a while for it to even start showing up on the outer layer of the bodysuit. If you can see I'm grabbing one piece of fabric here and there is the inner bra liner here so you've got a little bit of fabric here to kind of protect and absorb the sweat before it gets to the outside of the bodysuit. I'm definitely giving this a solid medium on the booty scale. From the side, it looks good. From the back, it also looks good. And it's just giving everything that it's meant to give. With the curved booty seam, as you can see, we are getting a little bit of a lift of the booty and with the glute seam right in the middle it gives the separation making your butt look really really nice so for squat proofness these are in my opinion squat proof i've worn these with underwear dark underwear black underwear to be specific and i've worn these commando and i find them to be quite squat proof and if you even wore nude underwear with this i feel like this color specifically the olive would still be squat proof. Now for cellulite friendliness and cellulite proofness, I would say that this is not cellulite friendly or cellulite proof whatsoever. So if you're someone who does get concerned about your cellulite or you're a bit more um, insecure about your cellulite, especially if you have more cellulite than me, then these may not be, the, this may not be the bodysuit for you. But overall, I do find that these are actually quite low in cellulite coverage. I just don't mind my cellulite showing, so I'm gonna wear these regardless of whether it shows my cellulite or not. My overall thoughts on this bodysuit for, what was it, almost $24 Canadian, $25 Canadian, worth it, worth every single penny, and yes, I'm gonna go and buy more colorways because I really do, at the end of the day, love the way this looks on me, especially the back. The back is just, in my opinion, a masterpiece. It is gorgeous, it is strappy, it is open for back day. Whew, back day is gonna be so much fun in this bodysuit because I love seeing my back muscles in action. So for me, this for, is such a find. This is one of the best AliExpress finds of 2022 in my opinion. Thank you so much for being here. Appreciate you and your time. If you found this video useful, make sure to smash that like and that subscribe button so that you never miss an upload from me in the future. And definitely make sure to leave a comment down below of a dolphin if you've made it this far. And let me know your thoughts on activewear bodysuits and if you like them or not. Now, as someone who does hold more belly fat, yes, I am a little bit more self-conscious when I wear bodysuits in the gym, but these pieces are so cute. And I just felt so bomb in it when I was working out in it that I'm probably gonna go and buy some more colors because I'm really, really loving this, especially the back. Like, can we just give the back a little round of applause because the back is absolutely gorgeous. If you're looking for other ways to support me besides liking and subscribing, pop over to my website www.fitnessbeyondaesthetics.com for my coaching, my Amazon finds, my discount codes, and anything else that you could possibly need. Always remember that your fitness goes beyond your aesthetics. It's not just about how good you look, baby. It's important to make sure that you feel good physically, mentally, and emotionally, and sexually as well. Watch the other videos that are on the screen, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.